Cooper and Company. I'm Keith Davis, ZTV Sports. Shut up, Bob. <laughs> Quit. We've got several area teams ranked, Jamie. Woo! The high school prep football. We had that story two days ago, but go ahead. No, let it go. Get it. You want to do it? I've already done it. <laughs> let me do but it. But go ahead. Athens. Two or three of those people watching might not have seen it. That's right. <laughs> let we me do it. I got ten seconds. Nine. Athens. Eight. No. Champions. Yeah. In the 5A. They're crazy. Jamie, they go. Ranked eighth in the 5A. Already, Johnson. I already knew that, but go ahead. Did you know Johnson, the Jags, ranked number two? I did not, but Keith, thank you. Number two in the 5A. Johnson. East Limestone, the Seven. Indians, and Coach Jeff Pugh. Now we're talking. Talked to him yesterday. I talked to him the other night. Yeah. <laughs> I, heard, I heard about that. Are you guys name Num- dropping here? Oh. Number seven, East Limestone. Of course, the Indians were eight and five last year, ranked number seven. Did you know Jeff and them got 19 seniors? No. That's something I didn't know. There you go. Yes. Keith's got it all. T- yeah, tell him. <laughs> Tanner, last year, 10 2, ranked number seven in the 2A poll. The Rattlers, Hazelwood, the Golden Bears, number six in 1A. Addison, number four, but you didn't know that. Didn't know that, Keith. Thank in, you. In 2A. <laughs> and uh, other people in our area receiving votes. Jamie, your friend up at Ardmore, Tracy Malone and the Tigers. Wes Morgan, our friend, Bob Godsey and the Hartzell Tigers. Speak, R.A. Hubbard. Never seen somebody have so many friends as Keith. <laughs> and the R.A. Hubbard Chiefs. UNA, Bobby picked number one in the Gulf South. I like Lions. that. Man. I Picture. like that a lot. Get How's your- my hair look? <laughs> <laughs> okay, season tickets, 765 Lion. Get your tickets. Their first game, September 8th, with Tussle them when they come in. Who? It's the team out of Tennessee <laughs> when they come in. Don't! <laughs> uh, September 8th. Braves won last night. Braves win. Braves win. 12 3 over Houston. I hate baseball. And uh, they'll play the Astros tonight at 635. <laughs> 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 You got anything in sports trying to raise money, cheerleaders, bands in your sports? Let me know at ZTV Sports. Thank you By very way, much. You know, Keith, getting all that in. Speaking of Jamie's hair, I do want to make one comment on this show, and I want everybody to listen. I have to clean and mop my ho- uh, floors at home today. Head can, too. I, can I borrow your head? <laughs> can I borrow your hair to go and mop my floor? <laughs> all right, let's get ready to go, to Mr. Chew Carnival Man, right now. This sports is sports sponsored by all the great folks down at Huntsville, Athens, the Cater Scottsboro, Madison. Give them a call, 881-5151. You know, we take care of a lot of those high schools that uh, Keith just mentioned. Absolutely. Like Athens, East Lime. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> oh, boy. All right, you know, here's we'll sports with Bobby. What's let's up? get to the Sports Med Sports Report. Huntsville Stars on the road. They will return. Turn next week. It's next Wednesday through Sunday, and they're taking. What they want for that team? Oh, a couple of dollars. I'm thinking about getting some investors. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna frugal them down to a dollar and a half. Now I'll buy. I don't it. doubt it. <clears throat> anyway, the Stars are home next Wednesday, all the way through next Sunday against Birmingham, the Barons. Baseball Hall of Fame, of course. Uh, earlier this week, Cal Ripken Jr., Tony Gwynn, two of the best baseball ambassadors in the history of the game. Two great guys, and they deserve to be in the Hall What's of Fame. What's the date? I was flipping through last night, and I was watching Bob Costas was doing a thing on HBO Sports. Mm-hmm. And he went, he said, said, this guy and Barry Bonds have something in common. This guy invented the steroid, and it showed him manufacturing it and everything. And that's the what Bonds got on. Really? Uh, Barry Bonds do did things, steroids. He does not deserve anything to compare with Hank Aaron. I agree. All right, Tony Gwynn had eight batting, batting titles, ripping in the course of two-time MVP. They're natural. They are natural. Over 2,600 at the uh, playing streak that Ripken had. He had 430 home runs. A lot of people don't realize that Cal Ripken Jr. hit a lot of home runs in Major League Baseball, but two of the great amb- ambassadors for baseball. Hey, Alabama, let's talk, let's talk a little Southeastern Conference football. You always like that stuff, right? You want to see my top 11? Bring no, up the no. top 11 on ZTV 11 right now. Coming out with our football oh predictions. Boy, here they are right 11. here. Yeah, Here's there. the top 11 <laughs> on ZTV 11. You're only doing that because we have a crimson head in the, in the building. No, I'm doing that because I like Alabama. Well, I, I think Saban's going to take us to the promised land. <laughs> <laughs> so last year, we suck. I just want to know, do you promise? All right, uh, no, Southeastern Conference, nothing. you know, everything starts tomorrow. Players <laughs> reported yesterday and today. Practice begins on Friday. Auburn. Uh, doing the same. Auburn, they're doing the same. They have 26 newcomers to the team for the Auburn Tigers. They have seven walk-ons. Tennessee, 27 new faces on the volunteer squad. 
All right, now the PGA Tour. Now they have that FedEx Cup Points Championship. It's very similar to what NASCAR does. The playoffs begin August 23rd. That's right, playoffs in professional golf. 144 players in the point standings advance to the playoffs, which begin later this month. Give me that baton. I'll <laughs> Give me that thing over here. I should have taken thing. this with me the other night. Don't oh, me. you used to be a twirler, didn't you? You're dangerous. <laughs> wow, look at that. I get an eye I'm put out with that. I'm trying to remember how you rotate it down the fingers, right? You're going to hurt somebody. Oh. Could be me. <laughs> Don't you, hit the star, Bobby. If you ever mouth off at me again. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Major League Baseball. Jamie, no. Jamie, no. Uh-oh, uh, uh, this is mine now. Major League Baseball milestones are still on hold. We're talking about Bonds, A-Rod, and Glavin. Still all three of them are on hold. Hey, I got sports, too. You finish. <clears throat> all right. Speaking of Cal Ripken, you know he, there is a baseball organization called the Cal Ripken Baseball Association. They held their southeast regional over at Phillips Park in Monrovia this past week. Uh, Tillman's Corner defeated Palm Beach, Florida, 8 to nothing in the championship game. And one of the reasons I mention that, it's a great organization, a great tournament out at Monrovia, but at the same time, last week they had their uh, opening banquet. Had a lot of fun. I was invited to be the MC. We just had a wonderful, and these are 10 year old kids. Keith, can you I'll wait till right break now, to go to the bathroom? I mean, we I'll tell you right now, here. they had such a great time in this entire tournament. They did a super job out there. Yes, sir. I've got a guest today, Bob. Can you kind of. Can I do something right quick? <laughs> Hey, let's go to the Tennessee Titans. Did y'all hear Bench Young yesterday? Well, I do my golf club. Oh, did a punch. You, you keep up with this, Bobby? Oh, absolutely. And then they told him, don't ever throw a punch with your throwing hand. Well, that's a smart thing to do. Yeah. You know, we're starting a football team here in Athens. Here's a shot of the new uniforms they're going to be wearing. Bill Cosby's, uh, you know, showing off here. This is a picture. Yeah, we're starting out a... <laughs> <laughs> I like that midriff. That's, that's, that's the way I'd look in one. Hey, that's OJ's number. That is you, isn't it? Yeah. I've been out in the sun a little bit too long, but yeah. <laughs> well, you know, with that helmet, now I know why your hair's messed up. That yeah. helmet has done it to you. Helmet head. Yeah. I've got that's it. this week's Sports Mid Sports Report, by the way. Hey, speaking yes, of sir, got, Keith's got another one. <laughs> it's coming out. Keith's special guest, we have time coming up next right here. The best looking thing of the whole program, I can tell you that. Hey, we're ready for it. I guarantee she's predicting Alabama's going to be number one from right here in Athens, Alabama. She, she better. You she know. better. All right. This has been another edition of the sports segment. There she is right there. We'll talk with her in just a little bit. So y'all hang on. It's football season a month away. Why is she running away now? She's running out the door. I mean, we scare her? We? I? Yeah. You? I, you. Keith? No, oh, Keith did. I've got a guess, Bob. Yes, you do. <laughs> got to Keith, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> Keith has charm. Don't he forget to vote today. August 14th. Vote to keep <laughs> Athens progressive and growing. Oh, gosh. Take a break. Be right back, y'all. Woo-hoo.